Hi, it's Chester at Blue Peak and Computer Training. And in this video, we're going to look at how to change the behavior of the Enter key. The Enter key by default would take you down a cell after you've confirmed entry within a cell. So, for example, if I type my name here, press Enter to confirm the entry, it takes me down a cell. Alternatively, by the way, you can press Tab to take your cross to another column. Now, there is a key combination that will leave you in the cell, and that's Control Enter. Don't confuse it with Alt Enter. That does something equally as useful. It creates another line within a cell. Now Control Enter is great if it's just one or two cells that you want to stay in after you've confirmed entry. But if you want to change the overall behavior of the Enter key in Excel, this is what you do. You go up to File and then down to Options, go down to Advanced. And then you've got a little option here after pressing enter, move selection. So if I untick that, click on OK, and then I type my name in here, press enter, I stay in the cell. Now if I go back to that, same option. If I tick it here, I can also change the default direction. So if primarily I'm entering data across a sheet rather than down, I could change the direction to right. So now if I type my name in a cell and press enter, it goes across to the next column. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please subscribe and I'll see you next video.